Hey, my bad, fam. My bad. I didn't know a Rose and Castle went together. I just saw the comment section right after I dropped Castle. It was like, a Rose, a Rose, a Rose, do a Rose next. A Rose. I'm like, oh, shit. Okay, okay. My bad. My bad. I guess I got to scrap normal. Got to push it back. A Rose is next up. Let's get straight to it. We're picking up right where we left off with Castle, so... Really looking forward to that. Appreciate y'all letting me know in the comment sections. Let's get straight to it. A rose. Let's see what he's talking about. If I could rewind time like a tape inside a boom box, one day for every pill or per cassette that I ate. Mm. Cut down on the volume. I'd have heard everything, but death is turning so definite. Wait. They got me all hooked up to some machine. I love you, Bean. Didn't want you to know I was struggling. Feels like I'm underwater, submerged like a submarine. Just heard that nurse say my liver and kidneys are functioning. Mm. Been flirtatious with death, skirt chasing. I guess it's a rebirth. I've been flirtatious with death, skirt chasing. I guess. Oof. Like in the background, I hear like hospital machines beeping. I hear like a breathing tube. He, him talking about like nurses and shit, kidneys failing, just the whole type of picture he's trying to paint. I feel like he's in a hospital, he's dying type shit. That's what I get from this. Let's get it, let's get it. What's going on? How'd you get here, um? Feels like I'm underwater, submerged like a submarine. Just heard that nurse say my liver and kidneys are functioning. Uh -huh. Been flirtatious with death, skirt chasing, I guess. Shh. It's a Reba Dirt J. Same nurse just heard say they're unplugging me, and it's your mm. birthday. Jade, I'm missing your birthday. Ah. Baby girl, I'm sorry. I fucking hate when you hurt, hey? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Jade, Haley Jade, his little daughter. He's gonna miss his... his he's, he's about to miss her birthday because apparently he's dying. He's hooked up to machines. I feel like this is when he overdosed back in 2007. And, like, you know what they say? Like, right before you die, your whole life flashes before your eyes. I feel like this is that moment when... You feel your body failing, your little eyes are darting across the room trying to make sense of what the fuck's going on. Your ears, like, the little bit of sound you can hear is just the nurses talking about, oh, your kidneys are failing, all the time, like, negative shit, like, hella, hella bad shit, nothing good. At the same time, you're thinking about those you're leaving behind. Everything happens in, the, in those final moments before you die type shit. Like, you go through your whole life, regrets, what you wish you could have done, and I feel like this is that moment that Emma is trying to capture right here. Let's roll with it. Let's get it. Shit deep. Dirt J, same nurse just heard say they're unplugging me, and it's your birthday. Jade, I'm missing your birthday. Baby girl, I'm sorry. I fucking hate when you hurt, hey? Uh -huh, uh -huh. And sweeties, thank you for waiting to open gifts. But girls, you can just open them. Dad ain't making it home for Christmas. Mm. Wish I had the strength to just blow a kiss. I go to make a fist, but I can't make when I'm frozen stiff. Ah. Yeah, but nothing comes out. I'm crying inside. I shout. My vocal cords won't permit me. I scream, but it's not allowed. <laughs> you put your arm around mama to calm a wow. I just thought about the aisle. I'll never get to walk his down. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. You know, listening to him talk about, I want to ball my fist, but I can't because I'm laying stiff. I want to scream, but my vocal cords won't let me. It's like you're trapped in your own body. You're crying on the inside. Like the inner you, you're trapped in this thing. This thing becomes a prison. And I think about people who suffer from various mental conditions or they're um, disabled. They can't move their body. And I just think about how hard that could be. Like how extremely difficult life must be like that when you just like trapped in the shell when you can't do anything i can't even begin to imagine what that's like man like my heart goes out to these people and i'm giving us a glimpse of what that feels like it's like i'm hearing him i'm listening but i it's like some things you can't really fathom or really understand until you in it the, the least i could do is just you know like try to relate to it and just like feel it from his point of view type shit you know that's the best that i could do but to sit here and say, like, I really feel you, am I really relate to what you're going through? I can't do that, man. Like, but I feel for you. Like, my heart goes out the way you're going through. I'm on the karma well. I just thought about the aisle. I'll never get to walk his down. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Never see you graduating your caps and gowns. It's about to be 2008. How's this happening now? Ah. I got so much more to do. And proof I'm truly sorry if I let you down. But this tore me in two. Mm. The thought of no more me and you. 
uh-huh. these shoes Nike's like new for me for school Duty, I'm trying, but you You were the glue that bind it So many uh-huh. things, uh-huh. time I'd give anything mm. to rewind it mm. I had to walk down my halls and constantly be reminded By pictures all on my walls and I couldn't sleep at night Cause ah. that image is burning my brain If you on that table, me falling across your body Not able to stand to save you Uh-huh, uh-huh, Eminem proof, like you know the history there, you know the bond they had, you know, like brothers, brother from another mother type shit, like, come on, man, come on, Eminem proof, best of buds, loved each other, respected each other, pushed each other, proof dying, put Em in a really dark place, like, it fucking kicked him over the edge, and like, he's already bad, Drug addiction got even worse losing proof because it's like now you're trying to cope. Like, how do you cope with the whole with everything going on in your life and then the loss of your best friend? You just go deeper into these drugs and now he's dying and he's like apologizing to proof because you know, but proof's already gone and now he's like, I thought he'd be like, there'd be a low sentiment of like happiness, like I'm finally gonna be with you, but it's not, it's just a lot of regret, it's just a lot of pain. A lot of fucking, you know, like flashbacks thinking back to the past and shit. My pictures all on my walls and I couldn't sleep at night Cause that image is burning my brain If you on that table, me falling across your body Not able to stand to save you God, why did you take him? Uh-huh. I'm trying to keep his legacy alive But I'm dying, where's Nathan? Little ladies, be brave Take care of your mother Smile pretty for pictures Always cherish each other I'll always love you And I'll be in the back of your memory And I know you'll uh-huh, never uh-huh. forget me Just don't get sad when remembering And little bro, keep making me proud You better marry that girl Cause she's faithfully down And when you're exchanging those sacred vows Just know that if I could be I mean, I think Duty and Nathan are proof Well, who is he talking about when he says little bro? Let me know in the comment section who he talking about Bring Thank my father too. I actually learned a lot from you. You taught me what not to do. Woo! And mom was out. I had the chance to have one last uh-huh, time. Uh-huh. An honest and open talk with you. Talk with you. Duty, I see you. I go to war. You know, when he said my father, I was like, whoa, I've rarely ever heard Eminem say anything about his father. And it's never anything good. So I was like, damn, is he finally going to open up and let out his true feelings? Hey, it was kind of like a psych moment, but hey, it is what it is, man. Heart to heart, honest and open, talk with you. Talk with you. Duty, I see you, I go to walk to you, and I can feel my soul leave my body and float across the room. Ah. Nurses lean over the bed, pulling tubes out. Then the sheet over my head, shut the room down. Girls, please don't get upset. I see them cheeks soaking and wet. Uh-huh. As you squeeze hold of my neck, so forcibly don't want to let me go pillow drenched. Emotional wrecks with every second each closer to death. But suddenly I feel my heart begin to beat slow than a breath. Machines go. Must have guessed the cheat codes to this shit. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm trying to rewind time like a tape. Find an escape. Make Let's a go, beat nigga. Let's go. Uh-huh. From this dream. Come on, Em. You got way too much to live for, my guy. Yeah, you fucked up. You went a little too crazy with the drugs, but you got way too much to live for. You got two beautiful girls that still need you. You got a whole fan base that still needs you, my nigga. Like, you ain't even reached your full potential yet. You barely scratching the surface. Imagine if Em died in 2007. Imagine all the music we would have been left without. Imagine going through life from 2007 to this point without even knowing... Missing out on all this music without even knowing that, hey, we could have had this shit. It's different when you're like, oh, we could have had that. But imagine living life without even knowing what you could have had. Damn. Damn. Like, No Love, the Lil Wayne tracks, Medicine Man, Rap God, fucking Music to be Murdered by, Kamikaze. Like, we would have been left without a lot of music. A lot. Like a tape, find an escape, make a beeline, trying to wake from this dream. I need to refine my uh-huh, inner strength uh-huh. to remind me, even if a steep climb, I must take uh-huh, uh-huh. to rewrite a mistake. I'm rewinding the two. 
abi. <gülüyor> hold on, hold on. What we doing here, Ev? What we doing? Oh, hold on. What? At the beginning of a road, you said there's like a, a wish I could rewind time, like it save in that boombox. And right before the switch, you start rewinding the tape to Castle. Is this why they say Rose and a Castle when the roads go together? I get it. I get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. To rewrite a mistake, I'm rewinding the tape. I put out this last album, then I'm done with it. 100% finished, fed up with it. I'm hanging it up. Fuck it. Excuse the cursing, baby, but just know that I'm a good person. Though they portray me as cold, uh -huh, and uh -huh. it's a good person. But I bet you they won't. I'm pledging to throw this methadone in the toilet. Spread these old letters. Okay, okay, the bars are different. I, I remember what he said here. The bars are different. He's switching it up. That's the first part of it sounds the same as like in Castle. But the second part he switched it up. I like that. I like that. 100 finished, fed up with it. I'm hanging it up. Fuck, Fuck it. it. Excuse the cursing, baby, but just know that I'm a good person. Though they portray me as cold mm -hmm, and the things mm -hmm. good person. But I bet you they won't. I'm pledging to throw this methadone in the toilet. Spread these old letters I wrote. I came back like a boomerang on him. Came back like a boomerang on him. Now uh -huh. a new day is dawn and I'm up Tuesday. It's morning. Now I know. Mm. Let's go. We back, baby. We back. Uh huh. Mm mm mm. He made it back from the clutches of death, the belly of the beast. Literally, he went to hell and back. And when you do something like that, it just gives you a new drive. You just have a new motivation, a new type of fire burning in you to go get it. You come back better. It's like it's a new you type shit, but a rose, hence the title, like the phoenix from the ashes and shit. Hey, hey, I appreciate y'all, man. Appreciate y'all for the comments, the love, the support. I can't do this shit without y'all. Y'all know what to do. I know y'all gonna do it. We fam, baby. Let's get it. I'm gonna catch you on the next one. Let me know what y'all want me to get to next, and I'm gonna get to it. I love y'all. Let's get it.